Maddie, overall, what's your overall thought right now heading close to small conference tournament action? Who's your teams? So we talked last week, and then the show didn't quite take. What's uh, in the cup? I said, Water. Yeah. I, I said how good UConn is, and then lo and behold, Creighton goes out and just stomps a mud hole in them the other night. Then Purdue, number two, goes out, loses to Ohio State. So maybe the two best teams aren't that far ahead of all the other teams. So I think it's like the uh, Tour de France, the Peloton or whatever it is that has closed the gap on the top two. So I think we have a race now. So I read a stat the other day. I'll actually give out probably on the next show. There's going to be 10 teams that you can basically lock in to win the national title coming up. So I already started the research and it's only 10. Uh, I mean, you might get two of those 10 into the final four with some other two yo-yos, but uh, the the model's been pretty consistent and right over the last couple of years. So some of the teams to actually just get ready for your bracket stuff, you can pencil UConn going far. You can pencil Creighton going far. I know Buckle like that. Um, A, a crazy one, to, to and it's going to draw some hate, Duke hits the model. So there's going to be some teams in there that people that like it's lightning rods. Duke's one of them. Creighton's going to be one of them. I think that's going to draw some, some fun brackets. Uh, I cannot trust Purdue though. Um, I think last year is more to come this year. Now I don't think they're going to lose first round, but I definitely do not think they will be in the final four. I just don't think they have it 